Hello friends, this video is about proteolytic enzyme digestion, one of the most important topic because this topic is asked in various competitive exams. Now when I say this topic is very important, that doesn't mean it is very difficult. It's actually very easy, just we have to understand few concepts. So here in this video, I'll be highlighting few concepts so that we can uh, answer any of the questions relating to this topic. So, firstly, what is a proteolytic enzyme? Proteolytic, is, proteolytic enzyme is an enzyme that cleaves the peptide bonds of various proteins of the peptide. It cleaves the specific peptide bonds, um, the bonds of the specific amino acid. Now, here I have highlighted few enzymes and their target site so trypsin here trypsin cleaves the uh, c terminal of lysine and arginine but if proline is present next to the lysine or arginine then trypsin cannot act on that peptide bond here and here is the second enzyme chymotrypsin that acts on phenylalanine tyrosine and tryptophan at its c terminal and pepsin also cleaves the same amino acid but it's but at its end terminal and cyanogen bromide targets methionine at its c terminal these four were the endopeptidases that is they cleave the peptide bonds present in between the amino acids not at the ends but these last two are exopeptidases now here carboxypeptidase a will cleave the uh, end the C terminal residue only if that C terminal residue is an aromatic amino acid and carboxypeptidase B cleaves the C terminal amino acid residue only if the basic amino acid that is arginine and lysine is present at the C terminal. So for those who are new to this topic might not be understanding what is C terminal and N terminal. Here I have highlighted what is C terminal and N terminal. So this is the amino acid, any amino acid. The bond which is present before proceeding to that amino acid is the N-terminal bond of that amino acid. So this is the N-terminal bond. And the bond present next to that amino acid is its C-terminal amino acid, C-terminal peptide bond. So here is the tripeptide, proline, lysine glycine so the n terminal peptide bond of this lysine is this okay this is its n terminal peptide bond and this is its c terminal peptide bond so if a amino acid is present here also say glycine is present over here so in that case this would be the n terminal peptide bond of proline and this would be the C terminal peptide bond of this proline. In same way, if there is another one amino acid over here, arginine. Then, uh, now this glycine's C terminal bond is this and N terminal bond is this. So, I think now you understand what is C terminal bond and N terminal bond. Now here is an enzyme, pepsin is added to the mixture containing this peptide okay this is the peptide now we know that pepsin cleaves at phenylalanine tyrosine and tryptophan and that too at its n terminal so now let's scan this peptide for the presence of these amino acids first let us scan for phenylalanine mm, it's present over here so this is its N terminal bond. So this is targeted by phenylalanine. And next let's scan for tyrosine. There is no tyrosine over here. Then next let's scan for tryptophan. Uh, tryptophan is over here. Now this pepsin targets the N terminal of this tryptophan. Now after cleavage we will get a tripeptide consisting of these amino acids see this is one small peptide 
and this is another one small peptide and this will be another one small peptide so after the cleavage we'll get one two three small small peptides this is the dipeptide these two are the dipeptides and this is the tripeptide now in many questions they'll be asked they'll be given one letter code of the amino acid so here you might want to pause the video and make a note of it here i have mentioned various amino acid their three letter code and their one letter code okay for so only these many things are necessary for uh, uh, answering many questions so hope you might find this video useful for you so please like comment and subscribe thank you have a nice day